In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing the reasons why a bauble is the great dog and why they may be suited to you. So let's get started with this video. Welcome back to the Fenrir Bauble channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Charlie and I'm a certified canine leader here at FenrirCanineLeaders.com. This channel is dedicated to helping you learn everything you could possibly want to know about the bauble and then how to become high level canine leaders that can raise the perfect bauble. So if you're a lifelong lover thinking about getting one or just started your journey with your new bauble, then this is the channel for you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a future bauble video. So then let's get into today's video where we'll be looking at why the bauble might be the best breed for you. If you haven't heard of the bauble or don't know much about them, we'll start today's video with a quick overview of the breed. The Bauble is a formidable breed that were bred by farmers in South Africa to defend their homes, land and livestock from predators such as hyenas, lions and all other kinds of African wildlife. They're hugely powerful dogs and males can easily reach up to 90 kilograms of power, most of which resides in their heads and jaw. For their size, they're one of the more agile mastiff type breeds and are highly intelligent. Now we'll explore the reasons why they make great dogs. The Ball Ball is a famously good guard dog. It was one of the jobs that they were specifically bred for. They're alert and fearless and extremely loyal to their families, especially children. Given the right socialization and training, the Ball Ball will be an impenetrable guard to your home and loved ones. Their strength and formidable appearance means that their presence alone can be enough to deter troublemakers or thieves. Historically, South African farmers entrusted the protection of not only their land and home to these dogs, but also their livestock too. This trait is a beautiful quality in these dogs. For a family that has taken the time to train and socialise their ball ball effectively, this dog will be ready to defend them at a moment's notice. To pair with being a good guard dog, the ball ball is extremely courageous. I mean, they had to be back in the day when they were coming up against predators such as lions and hyenas. But even today, they haven't lost that courage. The bravery these dogs can show is astonishing, willing to show any intruder that they are not to be messed with, no matter the size of the threat they're up against. For a dog to hold onto enough courage to protect land and livestock from savage wildlife is an incredible feat. The courageousness of these dogs can be cultivated and built upon with specific training methods. To give a bauble the tools to control their courage will earn you their respect. And in turn, that courage you've nurtured could one day save your life or even that of your bauble. We've touched upon how the bauble is especially good with children. And when we explored why they make such good guard dogs, but let's build up on why they're specifically good in a family unit. A love for human companionship and naturally protective temperament means that once they've bonded with a family, that bond is for life. If socialised correctly from the day that they get home at eight weeks old, they can learn to be gentle and calm around even the smallest of children. Their size can be an issue if they haven't learnt that a toddler won't withstand being battered, battered with an excitingly wagging tail. Instead, they will learn that smaller humans need a calm protector, and that is what they will be for them. For adults, they will learn different boundaries. No matter the size of the human in its family unit, a bauble will love them deeply, even if they know not to be a lap dog to a toddler. The bauble is a generally healthy, short-coated dog. In other words, they're fairly low maintenance. Yes, they need feeding and exercise and as much fuss as any other breed, but that's about all having a dog as part of the family. They were bred to be comfortably live out in the open of South Africa, and they wouldn't have been half as effective if they needed regular trips to groomers or vets. Their coat only requires light grooming, bi-weekly brushing will be enough to keep the skin and coat healthy. You may need to do it weekly come the summer months, but that can be incorporated into evening cuddles on the sofa. As for their health, look after them, feed them a good diet and exercise them, and you see them be with you without any medical interventions for a long time. Leading on from that, the bauble have long lives. For a dog of its size, the bauble has a relatively long life, provided they're able to live a healthy life until old age, they can reach up to 12 years of age. If you have taken the time and trained and socialized these dogs into well-rounded members of the family, they will just be a joy to have in your life that even 12 years will feel like a short time. If you happen to have young children when you decide that a bauble will make a good addition to your family, then the kids will grow up with a best friend. 
They will have a first protector that will see them well into their teens and even early adulthood. And what more could a child ask for? Let's do a quick recap of what we've learned today. The bauble has been bred to be incredibly courageous guard dogs. They have a fierce loyalty and love for their families and a special place in their heart for children. They can be an irreplaceable part of the family for a long time, giving you their protection and affection for well over a decade. These dogs are not for the faint-hearted, but for those that do decide to take on a bauble and put the time and effort into their training, they will find that their family would have gained an irreplaceable companion. Well, I hope you have enjoyed today's video. If so, make sure you hit that like button and get involved down on the comment section below. And don't forget, if you are new here, to make sure you subscribe. We have two dedicated bauble videos coming here every single week. So, I can't wait to talk to you again on the next episode of the Fenrir Bauble Show.